Hello everyone, welcome once again to our interview questions for the test automation engineers series this side brains so today we are going to talk about another interesting interview question that is how to close login window on make my trip website so before jumping on to the solution i would request you to please give it a try on your own and then come back to the solution so let us try to understand the statement problem statement i mean from the website so as soon as we will launch this makemytrip.com we will see this particular login window after some delay and what we want is we want to close this particular window by clicking on this particular close button right so let us try to understand the same by the practical demonstration but again before jumping onto the solution i would request you to please try it on your own so what i will do now i have already created one maven project and I'm having pom.xml where I have uh, I'm using selenium version 4.19 I have created one class make my trip class and there I have added one main method now I'm going to write very basic syntax to launch the Chrome browser so web driver driver equal to new Chrome driver so as I'm using selenium version 4. latest 4 version I mean that is 4.19 so in this case I don't need to download the Chrome, Chrome driver exe it will be automatically taken care by selenium itself using selenium manager class which is the integral part of selenium in case you are not aware how it automatically works i would request you to please check out my video which i'll be sharing in i icon next thing is what we are going to do we are going to launch this particular make my trip.com site so let me copy this particular url and put it here right and next thing is we need to perform click on this particular element so what we will do is we will get the location or we will get the locator of this particular element so let us get it using class span is first thing and then after add the red class and this is the class so this is how we can locate the element next thing is what we will do is driver dot find element by dot xpath and i'll provide this particular xpath and let us try to execute this particular program now and see whether it perform a click on that particular close button or not so you see it is launching makemytrip.com and then after it is showing this particular login window but we are unable to perform a click so let us take a look on the console so if you will if you will observe we will get element not intractable sometimes we will get no such element exception as well why we are getting because this particular element is not visible here because of we haven't maximized it second thing is this particular login window is appearing after launching this particular makemytrip.com meaning there is some delay when we launch this makemytrip.com and this particular login window appears right so first thing is what we can do is we can maximize it right so what we will do is driver dot manage dot window dot maximize so this is first thing second thing is we will introduce some weight web driver web driver weight so i'm going to use explicit weight so this is the syntax where i'm going to pass driver as first argument and then i'm going to use duration dot of seconds right so let us wait for five seconds and what we will do is now we have defined this particular explicit weight let us apply this on this particular element wait dot until this is the syntax so wait dot until and here we are going to use expected conditions dot visibility of element because we want to wait till the visibility of element and we are going to let us say copy paste this particular element right next thing is what we will do is we will capture this particular thing into one web element close button let us give it name close button right so if we are able to locate this particular element within five seconds what it will do is it will return one web element that is a close button web element and we are assigning it to close button and then what we are going to do we are going to perform a click on this okay and at last let us quit this driver as well right 
so let us execute this particular program and see whether we are able to close this particular window or not so you will observe it has launched makemytrip.com and it will wait and then after it will perform close this close on this particular window it is still not able to close this particular window because this particular element is still not visible so let us go here and see what is happening so what is the error we got so we are still getting no such element exception why we are getting no such element exception because element might not be visible so let us disable this particular bar as well right so in order to disable this particular bar we will have to use chrome options class so let us create chrome options options equal to new chrome options right then what we need to do there is one option options dot set experimental option where what we need to do we need to pass this particular thing that is exclude switches and what we want is we want to disable automation info bar okay so this is what we will provide here once we have defined this particular options the next thing is we need to pass it to the chrome driver so let us run this particular program once again and see whether we are able to click on this particular element or not so first of all it will launch and if you'll observe we don't have that particular window as well that particular info bar i mean and this is now able to click on this particular close button so why this particular program uh, is problem is tricky because sometimes you might not need to use this particular section meaning you don't need to use this particular enable action disable this particular info bar because sometimes element would be visible because if you'll observe some part is visible right so sometimes it will work even without this and sometimes it will work even without this particular explicit weight as well because what will happen is sometimes this particular login window is appearing as soon as we are launching makemytrip.com and in some cases what is happening is it is taking some time so that's why it is tricky so this is what i wanted to cover as part of current video so what we discussed that in makemytrip.com as soon as we launch this particular website we see this login window which appears after a delay so we tried closing this particular window so we tried clicking on it directly then we discussed uh, by introducing some weight then we discussed maximize this particular window and even then if it didn't work so we used this option to disable the info bar right so this is what i wanted to cover as part of current video thank you for watching guys i would request